Do you find yourself asking how your favorite producer gets their mixes so loud? I've got one great solution for you to make your mixes louder. Let's talk a little bit about soft clipping. Soft clipping is one of those buzzwords that a lot of producers are using today because it's actually the meta in mixing and mastering currently. It's a fantastic way to get your sounds louder without having to mess with the peak volume or any sort of volume knob at all. A great approach to mixing would be to find ways to make your sounds louder without having to touch the volume knob. That's gonna create a lot more space in your mix without technically turning anything up. Now, what exactly is a clipper? A clipper is something that shaves off transients that go above zero decibels. You might be saying, well, that sounds kind of like a limiter. A limiter and a clipper are actually very similar. One main difference between a limiter and a clipper, a limiter uses gain reduction. So without increasing the gain on the limiter, your mix will get quieter. A soft clipper has no gain reduction. A limiter will turn something down once it hits that threshold. A soft clipper will just shave off the transient and use digital clipping to shape the sound. Let me show you an example. Here's a drum loop without any clipping. Zero decibels. Now let's listen with the clipper on. This clipper is set to hard clip mode. We can turn it into a soft clipper by moving the softness knob. Check out the way the knee bends. Here's our sound with four decibels of gain. Still zero dB. You can hear that adding a clipper creates this nice sort of digital distortion. Now think about applying that to your master with or instead of a limiter. What I do, I'll clip my groups and leave my master completely empty. I can feel the criticism coming right now. But listen, it's important to understand with your mix what you value the most. For me, making bass music, loudness matters the most. So sure, I'll sacrifice dynamics sometimes to get there. I need my tracks to be loud. Think about what you need your track to be and figure out how to get there. There's nothing I would love more than to hear your mixing hot takes. Please let me know.